He's a fighter pilot and a showman. It's time for this week's Steam Sunday profile. KCAL 9's Chris Holmstrom headed out to Los Alamitos to see what it takes to become an Air Force Thunderbird. The U.S. Air Force Thunderbirds. A choreographed drill style demo showcasing military pride, precision, and courage. But what does it take to be a Thunderbird? I took the Toyota Mobile Weather Lab to Joint Forces Training Base in Los Alamitos to find out. All right, so this is a Lockheed Martin F 16. It has two seats, it's a combat capable trainer variant. Major Brandon Felker pilots the number eight Thunderbird jet. We're just going to open the canopy and see if we can take a peek inside. The Irvine native who graduated from the U.S. Air Force Academy faced lots of competition before being selected for the team. So all of our pilots are highly experienced combat fighter pilots. Before each show, an inspection of each jet, which means pilots have to understand the mechanics. There's also a briefing that includes a climate report. We have three different shows, so if there's a low cloud deck, we can't do our high show with loops and all the rolls, so we can do either a low show or a flat show based on the weather. While all the steam disciplines come into play, math is especially critical to the safety of formation flying. For instance, our solo pilots, as they do their opposing passes, they're trying to cross right in front of the crowd. And so they use a lot of math and timing in order to try and make that hit happen exactly where it needs to be. And get this, the F-16 can pull up to nine Gs, but what's a G? A G-force is a force of gravity. For example, take Major Felker. He weighs 155 pounds. On Earth, he's one G. At two Gs, he would weigh twice that. If you get to the loop on a roller coaster, at that top of the loop and you feel like you're being pressed down into your seat, and that's probably about two and a half Gs. Major Felker always knew he wanted to be a fighter pilot. The work to get here was tougher than he ever imagined. But what he gets to do now has made it all worthwhile. Chris Holmstrom, KCAL 9 News.